Hello and welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, I will show you how you can add a table of contents on your Shopify article page within just two, three minutes. So uh, let's get started. So the uh, demo of the table contents is here, you can see. And uh, obviously you can change the background color, you can change the uh, font size and the font color as well. <clears throat> and by default, the font color, the link color uh, will be added on your theme, based on your theme. So uh, let's get started. So here you can see, uh, I don't have any table of contents. So the first thing, uh, I have to go to the themes and then from here, you need to click edit code. And then uh, you need to find the main article page. So I'm just, just searching for article. And here you can see article.json templates. And at the very first, uh, you can see main, right? So main and type is main article. So I, I have to find uh, this main article section. So let search main dot article. So that is the main article dot liquid. So on this uh, main article, uh, we can just uh, paste a code. So scroll down to bottom before the schema, give some space and copy the code I will provide and paste it here. Uh, please check the code in the video description code link and save it. And if I refresh here, you can see the table of contents has been added. And this uh, table of content has been added based on the S2 tags. So on your article, uh, the first one is uh, S1 tag. Uh, that's the article title and uh, all are the S2 tags. So you have to maintain this like H2 tags. And this is also essential for uh, SEO. Uh, now uh, some themes uh, uh, may have a different class like uh, here I have, here I have uh, added this class article template. So some theme has different class. So you need to uh, right click here and inspect element then click here and click on the content content of the article so whether it's the main image and here you can see the main article section you can see article article template uh, this may have different like article section article part uh, any other class so you just need to uh, copy the class and come to the code and replace it here. If you don't have any class on the article tag, just copy the article tag and come here and put just article without the comma and save it. It should also work. You can see it's working fine. So I hope uh, this video will be helpful uh, for you. Please let me know if this video find helpful for you.